got this scooter to try out and I've been really impressed with it so far. I took it on a couple test runs. It comes 95% assembled. You have to put on the handlebar assembly and there's a little connector inside here that gets put together. It has a USB port for being able to charge off of this. You can charge your devices off of it. You don't want to put a lot of weight on it, but it does have a nice little hook to be able to put a little bag on there. So this button here activates the turn signal. Look at how nice that illuminates there. And then turn it off, you just hit that same signal again to turn it off. Other side, same thing. So really, really nice safety features on this. The headlight here, at night, it really shines bright. So we have that light there, and you can see the tail light as well. Really, really nice. You hit the brake, and it blinks, so it lets you know, people know that it's braking. Really good intuitive features on this thing. It has a kickstand, in case you didn't want to hold it anymore, to lay it down, and then to turn it off, just hold down the power button until the digital display turns off. Instead of it having a manual bell, it has a bell built into the handlebar here, which is a pretty nice way to be able to have it. Very comfortable ergo grip. Power button here, very intuitive. You hold it down and then the digital display lights up, lets you know how much charge you have, and then also tells you your kilometers per hour here. And how do you get going? Well, it has a sensor on it, so it won't go until it feels pressure on it. So I have to put my foot on it, get going, and then it'll get going. You just give it a little tiny bit of a kick, and then it, and then it starts going, and boy, does it really start going. Once you get going, whoa. I had this thing up to 25 kilometers an hour, it even has a regenerative brake, so you can push this side here to brake. It also has a brake built in to the tail piece here. So if you wanted to have two tail, two different braking systems, put your foot on here to brake, but then this one here works really well. I did this on a hill yesterday, and it was even able to get me on a nice grade hill down to be able to have me to stop on it. Coming down the hill there, Look at how nicely it breaks it using the regenerative brake. Always make sure that you're wearing your safety equipment when doing this. So, but this is great for commuting, for going on errands, going to work, just anything that you're looking to do that you want some transportation where you're not looking to get hot and sweaty. This can be a great thing. When you're done riding it, turn off, hold down the power button until the screen turns off. And then this folds down so it's nice and easy. It has a little safety lock on it so it can't come undone unintentionally. Push that safety lock down and you pull on that and then the handlebar pushes down so that now you can transport it. Really sleek design, really easy to make happen. I really like this. I know you will as well.